In an era in which we are questioning the effectiveness of markets in producing the kind of society and economy we want to live in, it is more important than ever to have an objective debate about the role that markets and the state play in the economy. Is the state necessary only to correct market failures, or is it also needed to more actively shape and create markets and technological opportunities, and to promote growth which is not only smart, but also inclusive? We constantly think of the state's role as only fixing market failures. The theory that you have a government because of market failure is a disastrous theory. And, uh, important thing that we have to remember is that there's no scientifically defined boundary of the market. The state and the markets, they're always tied together, uh, not only in economic theory, but also in virtually all social sciences. For businesses to create stable, long-term jobs, particularly in a high-wage economy and be productive, it needs the government to be there persistently to develop in this physical infrastructure, the knowledge base that none of these businesses, even the most powerful business in the world, won't invest into. We really need to start linking up micro and macroeconomics much more. We cannot just talk about, you know, the importance of fiscal spending on anything, because in fact, there's evidence that when government spending is directed, directed towards some sort of broadly defined area, whether it was IT in the past or green in the future, the spending multiplier is actually three times as large.